Okay, good morning everyone. Today we're going to be doing some unboxing. Now I have some of these Pump It Up and Demiro starter packs for a trading card game. Now, from what I understand, the trading card game kind of failed. It didn't really take off. And they're pretty much exclusive to Mexico. This was a long time ago now. The date on these cards, it reads 2004. I don't know if you can see that at the bottom. Everything's in Spanish. So, uh, one of our friends in Mexico, he managed to secure some of these cards. They're super hard to find. But I have three starter packs here, they're all sealed, and they offer booster packs too. But um, yeah, pretty much discontinued, you can't find them anywhere. I'm going to set two aside. Uh, these two, maybe I'll have a competition, or maybe I can think of something for a giveaway. I'm not really sure yet, but they're all sealed. That's for the future. But today we're going to unbox this one and see what's inside, see what special cards are in here. See what we, uh, I don't know, see what we have to offer. I've never opened one before, so it's going to be a new experience for all of us. And, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Doing a pretty bad job with this. Let's see if we can get in at the bottom. Okay. <laughs> there we go. All right. So it's been sealed for 20 years. Wow. It hurts to do this. Okay, well, the damage is done. So I think there is 50 cards inside. How, how, did, how did dealers and people get in these without damaging everything? Okay. I have like caveman hands. Okay, well that's it. So what do we have in here? Well, let's look at the backs first. Look at that. So we have some instructions. Because it's a starter pack, you can see the back of the cards there. Looks cool, doesn't it? We'll look at the cards in a second. But because it's a starter pack, you get the little manual here. It teaches you how to play the game. It's like, take three cards from the deck in your hand. My Spanish is bad, but I guess I can understand a bit of it. So a message from Andamira. So 2004, it seems pretty much all over this deck. So here's the manual. We'll just have a little flick through real quick so you can see. <laughs> you can get combos. So I don't think they did a Korean version even. Not even an English version. Although the cards, I think, are, are in English. I will see in a second. Well, you can see how it all works. If I try to remember, I'll put a link in the description to scans of all these cards. I have uh, scans of every card, so even if you can't get a deck, you can print them out or send them to a, a game company. Maybe they can print them out for you and you can make your own, your own deck. So I'll try and remember to link that in the description below. If not, remind me in the comments and I'll, I'll do it. I think things like this are important to preserve. So what do we have? Circus Magic. Wow. I love that song. I'm not going to take too long with these. These almost look like mana cards or something. Uh, Always. Maria. Oh, tough song. Uh, Missing Mime Second. So, that, yeah, no, they are in Spanish. Everything in Spanish. Oh, that's interesting. Run to you. Oh, I like that song. Uh I still play that now, it's still in Phoenix. It's a great song. Love, let the sun shine in. Uh, heartbreak, curiosity. You can see it has the old kind of background wallpaper there. For any of you guys that used to play the game a long time ago. Oh, run. Love, final audition too. I still like this song, it's great. Most of the new players hate it, but I think it tests your ability. Uh, point Break. I think they added a new chart to that recently. Wow. Oh, these are super interesting. Ah, oh, Fighting Spirits. 
Oh, we've got all the freestyle songs. Oh, join the party. Oh, bring back join the party. What an amazing shot. I was looking through the camera and I didn't know that this was the holographic one. That's super cool, isn't it? So I'm not sure if you get one per starter pack or how many, but this is the only holographic in this pack. And it's probably one of the better songs it could be. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with that, actually. That's pretty cool. Space Fantasy. As I told you, hate. I had a couple of these cards before. I gave a few away and I sold them, but they were individual songs. <laughs> Hello. So I, I got them from the big one in Colombia, but it, I think it was just seven or eight cards. I bought them all individually. But it's, it's the first time I've actually owned a, a whole pack here. Zang. Zang, that's an arcade chain in Korea. Zang. Ignition starts. Oh, wow. I haven't seen some of these titles for so long. Some still survive pump uh, even today. Oh, gi, di, gang, oi, oi, oi. Uh, there is power of me. Wow, she likes pizza. And, oh, another one. Got a duplicate. So that is what's in a starter pack. Now, each starter pack is different. Um, so inside this one, um, I don't think it's going to be the same. Mainly because I asked the guys in Mexico and they told me it wasn't the same. So I trust them. <laughs> so inside these two sealed ones here, they're going to be different cards to what I showed you. But it's just an example of um, something that kind of failed from Andamiro. I, I kind of wish it did take off. I'm not sure why it didn't. But... Uh, again, yeah, exclusively in Mexico, and there's not really many left. It's, it's pretty limited and pretty rare, but if you guys didn't know it existed, well, you do now. You can see what's inside a starter pack. Again, I'll, I'll probably update you guys in the future, the uh, future of these two packs. I'm not sure yet. I think we're going to do a giveaway. But that's, uh, yeah, 50 card starter pack. Uh, pump it up trading cards. Look at that. All right. Okay, that was it. I hope you enjoyed the video, something a little different, and I'll see you guys in another video very soon, which I'm sure will feature this game. Okay, take care.